That's a good shot. Hit it very square and very firmly. Oh, lovely timing. That's a good shot. The leg glance has become very important in the one-day game. You can pick up a lot of boundaries from that shot. This is really well played by Afridi. Just strained down. It's nicely struck. Whoops. It's gone a bit crazy with the running between wickets. And now Mongia is hurt. He's popped it right in the forehead. He's been in the wars a bit lately, uh, Mongia. Caught one uh, right in the chin. And he, he may have got a, a bit of a whiplash effect there. He's grabbed for the back of the neck. And that could be because uh, I think ball is... You see there, Freedy, he's trying to cover the throw. And suddenly he realises he had his head down going at 100 miles an hour. Mongia was concentrating on the ball, trying to get to the stumps. Neither saw each other until the very last moment. So a little bit of a nasty collision there. Well, Alfredi will be able to get plenty of treatment because he's heading for the pavilion. Not so easy for Mongia. I'm not surprised that he's got a neck problem because uh, it would have been a bit of a whip. Well, that's a magnificent shot. He hasn't even moved. Classic. Absolutely classic. Run. And that's over the top. Beautiful shot. That's for eight on the over. In fact, it's nine on the over because there's a no ball as well. Pakistan post and he walloped that straight off his pads. Well, this is a typical side on shot. Middle and leg. He's just picked it on the up and hoisted it over mid wicket. One bounce over the rope. And he's picked the slower one, but he's not middle it. Agar Kar has struck here. He's already bowled two of them in this over. And it was third time lucky for Ajit Agar Kar. Unworth the man dismissed. And that's a big wicket for the Indians. Well, none of the batsmen have... So Ija is off the mark here. Prasad will be disappointed at the line of that delivery. He's angled onto his pads, and he just got enough bat on it. Straight away wrapped on the pads, and Kumble has struck with his very first delivery. Once again, he's got out Ijaz, and once again, he's out leg before wicket. Well, he seemed to get caught in an awful position, almost playing back to a full length delivery. Oh. So Enzamam off the mark in style here. Good timing for the onside. And he'll get three. But overall, a good over for the Indians. That three runs coming off it. But uh, the important thing was they picked up the wicket of Ijaz. 48 for three. And that one, we'll have to wait and see whether that didn't just balloon over short leg. Leg by. And that's good field placing too. He had the man on the, uh, the off. He's done him in the air. This could be a run out. It will be a run out. It is a run out. Inzamam is absolutely filthy with his partner. But if Pakistan have lost their fourth. That's a great breakthrough again for India. Vasti was not looking at the ball or at the non striker's end. It was Inzamam's call. The ball had gone down to short fine leg, and there seemed to be a run there. Good shot. Opportunity really to exercise that shot. Well, he just tried to be a little bit too clever, did Jadeja there with a slower ball, but there was no disguise in it. And he through that area. Well, I think against Joshi, you're better off hitting him straight. It should be straightforward to hit him down the ground. Look here, you can see the man's... Oh, 
Well, it was as simple as that. Ian Wasty uh, gave a dress rehearsal, which Jadeja couldn't take. Now Karazi has got a charge behind Square and he won't get there. And the reverse sweep played in style by Moin Khan. He's a cheeky cricketer. It was a premeditated shot and it came off. This is where Moin Khan is so brilliant. He can... we'll look for two here and get it. So that's 50 for Salim Malik. He's held the Pakistan innings together here. And if Pakistan do cross 200, which they should, then this man has been largely responsible for allowing them to get there. Reminded him to be a little careful. He's gone this time. Another slow delivery. He tried to drag it around the corner. He couldn't get it around enough and only managed to find Ravid. So a good knock from Malik comes to an end. And he looks for the quick single, sent back and run out. Jareja very quick to come in there. Good pick up, quick release. He hit the stumps direct. And Wasim Akram has been dismissed. So another run out. He clears mid off here and he'll reach the boundary. Now that's unlucky for the bowler, but Mohan Khan won't mind it. He's brought up his half century here and he's got two boundaries in that last over. So another very, very useful lock by the Pakistani wicketkeeper. But Azar Mahmood has still found the gap. There was long on, there was deep mid wicket, there was deep square leg. But Azar Mahmood has found the gap between long on and deep mid wicket. And again, but this time, long on underneath it makes no mistake. Robin Singh, the fielder there. So Azar Mahmood here perishing in trying to accelerate the scoring. Well, Azhar had no option but to take the aerial route. Couldn't middle it uh, as he wants. Now this is up in the air. And taken at long off. He's got a good pair of hands on Joshi. He doesn't miss many. So Mohan Khan too trying to clear the boundary. Has lost his wicket here, but it's been a very useful inning. He's got it away on the onside. They should get two here. So the Pakistan innings coming to an end. After 50 overs, they're 205 for nine. Very good partnership between Mohan Khan and Salim Malik. Four. really flowing and uh, the batsman there Kurasir getting way too far across and the ball has just clipped leg stump sure pace there from Shweb after and that's beautifully timed that's four it was in the air but it went very quickly to the fence Total control of that shot. That is beautifully played. That's copybook stuff. Well, that was a terrific shot. Banged it in, Shoy Bakta. It's quite sharp. By the time uh, the 35th over starts, that should be another boundary. Again, a lovely shot from Rahul Dravid. Good balance, 
Body weight leaning forward. And the placement was good too. Again, the quicker delivery, and that's gone past slip. Just enough legs on it to reach the boundary. Edged and again pass up from. And this will again go to the boundary. Difficult chance, but it was in the air. Now that was good bowling by Saklin. That stopped on the batsman, bounce turned, took the edge. Oh, that's a very good shot. Sweet timing. Rahul Dravid has looked in very good form in this innings. There was an illustration there. Oh, that's a way for four. Four wides. See, Makram had taken a slip and Azhar Mahmood had pulled just a little away uh, from, the out, from the off stump of Ramesh so that there's a chance uh, for a first slip take. Oh, and that's a beautiful shot. He really does play that one well. He times it exquisitely. It's not going to go all the way. It's just slowed up a bit, but they'll pick up three. Once he gets his eye in Ramesh, anything on that leg stuff really does disappear. And again, just worked off the hip. That one he tried to bang in and nothing happened. Very good 50 for Ramesh. That's two he's got now in the Coca-Cola Trophy. Indian supporters delighted. So is the team. Very well played by the young man. Beautifully struck. That's a great shot. One of the shots of the night, that. Straight down the ground. And this will bring up uh, Dravid's 50. It's been a fine innings from the right hand. Gets his 16.50. He's going to contribute to it. Well, that's an excellent shot. Beautifully timed again. Well, that'll be four. That's well hit. Saklan Mustak flighting that one a little more. Well, Captain Well. Yeah. Zinzamam who's got 100. Ijaz has got 100. And a run out here. Ramesh slip. That was unfortunate. And against they're going to play here. India have lost the wicket. Number three Indian batsman. To frustrate him. No, never run out here. This time it's Dravid's turn to go. Jadeja was the one who played the shot. Dravid charged off. And I think he heard the call late. So two wickets have fallen pretty quickly here. Straight to the man at Gully, and it's taken on the fall to show him up the rest of here again. Ijaz made it look so easy. Just for a moment, you thought that the ball had gone on the first bounce. It went like a rocket, but straight to Ijaz. And Shoaib Akhtar has done the job here again. And Kamli takes the aerial route and does it in style. In fact, it was Robin Singh. That was a good hit. It was pitched up and Robin Singh went after it. The field was up and he cleared it on quite easily. Dropped. The chance was there. Azar Mahmood was the fielder. So 
Gwyneth Conley on strike. There is a long off for him. Vidon's up in the circle. And punch through the offside. Might just reach the fence. And it actually does. Boundary signal. India have won this match. By six wickets.